Hey guys, what we have here is the Rider Glider. It goes by many names, but this one here, this is what I'm calling it because it has a couple of unique functions. So this is just a basic overview. So a person would sit on it and a dildo will come up. And all you have to do is just rock back and forth. Find your sweet spot. That's totally adjustable. So if you wanted to change the angle dildo you would loosen up the cam down here and you would move it back and forth until you find that right angle. So right there is about 90 degrees and also you can control the depth so the way it's set right now is basically middle of the road middle ground but you can go deeper and you can go shallower. You just go ahead and loosen up these knobs and you can drop it and it'll go deeper with shallower strokes or a rocking motion. Or you can go really shallow. Like that. Now another thing I wanted to point out is that it is got a Doc Johnson plug and dildo attachment. The cool thing about that is that it's it's interchangeable. Doc Johnson makes a good product, and that's why I chose to uh, go ahead and use their product for this particular glider. The other thing is, is on the bottom side here, you have an on and off switch. This has seven different vibration and strength patterns, and it also comes with a remote. Now, the remote's not shown here, but you can put the remote right here on another magnet, and that'll hold it. Now this is good for cam girls putting on shows, or this is good for couples who want to spice up the bedroom a little bit, put on a show for one another, or it's just good for somebody who likes to get off on a regular basis. Now this one here, this particular one that I made, I made it for somebody else, so it's not for sale, but uh, they've used it a few times and they really enjoy it. They said that uh, it stretched out their uh, pelvis, you know, so they have more range of motion. You just sit there and watch TV and have multiple orgasms and have a good time. So there you have it. It's uh, roughly 15 inches tall, so it's very comfortable. Fits most heights, so for the, even the, for the tallest or the shortest person, it's pretty average. And it's, it's fully adjustable, and it is for sale. So if you get a chance, please check out my Etsy. That's where I'm selling these. I have one that's for sale right now. I am asking a pretty fair price for it. I'm asking $900. It also comes with the plug with the magnetic base. By the way, these magnets are very strong. They're not going anywhere. They will hold that dildo in place with no problem whatsoever. Uh, if you were to look up anybody else that's selling these, they're either going to be some kind of a knockoff that's, well, to put it politely, it just is going to be an inferior product. This is not inferior. We used heavy-duty bolts. These are Allen bolts, so it looks cool, but they're chrome. And this one here is not an Allen bolt, but based on what was available to me, that is what, uh, what I used, but it's still stainless steel. And uh, the person that owns this weighs well over 250 pounds and has been using it consistently. And it has not broke, worn out, or loosened. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's high quality. It just doesn't get any better than this for the price. Uh, I know that the original guy that invented this particular rocker glider, he's asking $4,000 per unit. When he was selling them in mass, he was asking $1,500. And it didn't come with a 7-inch dildo attachment or a plug like mine does. So, again, please take that into consideration when looking at this. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. And I also hope you have a great rest of your day. Thanks.